Loving You For Life um, is a special song because it is uh, featuring Little Kim and you know based on people's <laughs> knowledge of our past um, you know it's pretty well known that we've had a few different run-ins <laughs> uh, with Big being the common denominator um, but um, contrary to popular belief I mean I when Big passed away you know I really all of that stuff kind of went out the window for me but I think um, it over time you know Kim is a different person now she has a, she's a mom and she may not have really been ready to receive um, the fact that I kind of wasn't really tripping off of any of that stuff for a while I think she's even said that you know why I you know probably said hi to her a few times in public or and I don't think she really was ready to receive my well wishes at the time but they were sincere and um, when we when we actually got a chance to um, talk a little more when we were rehearsing for the Bad Boy tour, the recent tour we did, and I told her that I really, you know, want her to be on this project. And she was like, okay. And when I finally got the song, which is based on, we took, I took um, Big's vocals from his song, Missing You, which originally featured 112. Um, and I um, arranged it as such so that I could include a verse for Kim. And, um, you know, people that have heard the song, you know, think it's really dope. Not only that we're on a record together for the first time, but also that the song happens to be about, you know, not only missing him, but reflective of, you know, actually being in love with him. We both, we both were in love with him, you know, at one time. So that's the truth. This is what it is. <laughs> and, um, you know, I think people kind of understand that it's like, that's, some people say, well, that's big of you, but I'm like, well, I mean, I'll take it, but I'm like, well, she's dope, and the song is dope, and I think it's something that people have been waiting for, and I think it's something that Big is really proud of, you know? Um, she did a great job on it. I allowed her, and I actually asked her to, you know, be in that moment of how she felt, you know, not so much sugarcoating it, you know? talk about how you really felt. And she's like, I miss kissing you. I miss cooking for you. And that's cool. She, I'm, I'm sure she kissed him a lot. <laughs> so it's like, okay, I mean, I'm, it's, it's the real world and I'm woman enough to say, let's talk about it. I think people, you know, maybe it'll help somebody else get over carrying grudges. I don't know, but it's a great song. And, um, you know, I, I just can't wait for people to, um, to hear it and hopefully they appreciate it.